Hello everyone, uh, this is the Hunter Collector with another action figure review, and here we have the Marvel Legends series Thor 11 Thunder Groot, or Teenage Groot. I don't have the original Teenage Groot from the Thor, Rock, and Groot 3-pack from, I think, Toys R Us, uh, and Toys R Us is in the U.S. have been closed down, so I have not been able to get that, and it's pretty pricey right now, so I'm happy I got this. Uh, I'm excited to open it, so uh, let's go over the packaging. So first, we got the Marvel Legends logo here on the top. Thor Love and Thunder logo here in the bottom, Groot. Here is the cider of Teenage Groot, which I think is the same cider as the last time. And then here is the other, uh, here's the back side with that same artwork. And then here is Groot with the description there where it just says, I am Groot. Um, and then Marvel Legends logo here in the top corner. And for this wave, we are building Korg. Uh, so for this wave, we got the armored Thor with the golden blue armor, Jane Foster Thor, Gore the God Butcher, King Valkyrie, Ravager Thor, um, Star Lord, which we already did, and Ravager Thor, we also did. And now we're doing Groot. Here's the other side art. Here is the top with the broken hammer uh, from uh, for the emblem. And then here is the bomb with the DCPI. But besides that, let's crack them open. And here is Groot out of the package here. So let's go over the accessories. So first we get Korg's torso, which we'll go over once we build them. And then here we have this really cool blaster here, which is awesome. Looks pretty cool. Nice sculpt. You got a peg there for if you have those blast effects, you can put it in there if you want. So it's a really cool sculpt. It's just all gray, though, or gum all gray, whatever you want to call it. But, yeah, this is a really cool blaster. I like the sculpt on it. And then we get these two branches here, one which which is kind of like a branch that, you, that you're meant to, like, stab people with. Uh, and you get all these really cool, like, leaves and green vines going through it, which is really cool. It's even more green, so that's really cool. And you get the brown branches all the way to the point, which is awesome. And you got this disc hinge joint here, so if you put it on his arm, it actually articulates, which is really cool. And then you get this other one where it's just all branches and stuff like that coming out. Uh, so same deal, you get all these, like, green vines and leaves and thorns coming through. Looks really cool. It's like kind of sporadic to catch people. So that's awesome. So this is really cool. And you get that same joint there to use. So yeah, and it's pretty soft. So you can kind of mess with it a little bit. Kind of tangle figures up if you want to try to get Groot to seem like he's catching them. So yeah, that's pretty cool. And then you get this extra hand here for his blaster to hold, to hold onto his blaster. So yeah, you get that nice green vine there in his arm. And then all brown, kind of like slender fingers there. So that's pretty cool. And that's all we got for the uh, accessories. So here is Teenage Root up close. So you get this nice like tree bark texture going on here and gets more green towards the head. And you get these like leaves coming out of his head. And you get that like little trunk look there. You get the black eyes. Kind of looks pissed. And then here is the torso with all those tree bark pieces there too. With some green around that. Some more green. And then the thighs with some vines coming out of there. And shins. You get two different feet actually to give it that like differentiate uh, nature. Like nature doesn't repeat itself. And then you got the arms here with some vines coming out of there too. And then you got the open hands here. Pretty spiky fingers there. And then here's the other arm with some more vines coming out. And then more wide open hands, so that's cool. And then that's all we got for the looks. So, oh yeah, and then here's the back with the group back and butt and everything. And then we'll, now we'll go over the articulation. See, so it has a disc ball jointed head that hinges down that far, looks up that far, left and right motion, a lot of head pivoting actually. Shoulders move out just that far. 360 rotation there, though. Single jointed elbows, pivots, wrist can hinge down that far, up that far. 360 rotation. Uh, he has a ball joint at the diaphragm, so you can go forward that far, backward that far, side to side motion, some twisting. Legs kick out that far, forward that far, backwards just a little bit. Uh, you got single jointed uh, knees. You can also pivot around there. And then you got, you can, 
ankles hinge down that far, up just that far, and ankle pivot. And that is Teenage Group from Thor Love and Thunder Wave. I think it's a really cool figure. You got a lot of texturing, really good job to paint, and nice. like I said, the accessories are awesome. You got all that nice detail there. You got different hands for him to hold on to the blaster. Articulation is really good, like I said. Um, it's a pretty skinny figure, so it's kind of hard to get uh, a lot of articulation in the skinny figure without messing up the look of the figure but they did a really good job on this so uh without messing up the uh, look of it too much or actually then i could it doesn't barely even mess with it actually um so you got a lot of articulation for just a skinny figure um i do do wish that they did a little bit of a darker brown wash over it just give it like more texture and detail to it but that's really it for like suggestions but yeah that's all i really got for this guy i think it's a really cool figure i recommend you get him I'm happy I got him because I missed out on that three pack. So, uh, yeah, I'm happy. I'm going to put him in my Avengers Endgame shelf because, you know, he was in there. Uh, but, yeah, that's all I really got for this figure. If you guys want to check out and help support me on my other accounts like TikTok, Twitch, or Instagram, go ahead and check that out in the link tree in my description. I also do brief reviews, reviews on these figures if you want to check those out. Also on my TikTok. But besides that, that's all I really got. So thanks for watching.